How's it everyone? This is Lokahol and in today's video we are going to be doing a double corruption part 2. And as you can see, we have a lot of big stuff here. We've got 7 headhunters. I'm also going to get a couple more. And then we have a squire and some bows that were crafted. This one is particularly disgusting. These fancy boots, cool stuff, and of course, the thresher. The 1000 PDPS Thresher, which we will do right at the end. Oh, and a Mage Blood. Hey, anyway, let's just jump straight into it. And I think what we're going to do, just to warm it up, is do uh, five of Queen Meowza's Headhunters. Number one. Let's see what we get. By the way, Queen Meowza is a great streamer. I'll link her channel in the description. She provided five headhunters and a squire for this. So let's see how we go. First one, nothing happened. Very boring. Let's go next. Number two for Queen Meowza. Let's see what we get. Energy and grace aura effect. Those kind of don't really. It's not terrible. It's not terrible, I suppose. Alrighty, number three. Let's see if we can finally get a poof. Yay. <laughs> it only took like seven headhunters. I'm also counting the previous videos, but yeah. Rip, finally a poof. Let's go next. Number four. Oh, what? I keep getting these types of things. Hatred and discipline. That's very interesting. I think it's very good for certain niche builds. But yeah, I mean, damn, I'm not complaining about that. Okay, last of the first of Queen Meowza's Headhunters. Let's see what we get. And we finally got a break. All right, well, three out of five survived. And we got a couple that are pretty interesting. Let's move on to the next set of items. All right, this is a big one. These items all come from Zeus. And we're going to start it off with this bow, which is nuts. It's a 600 PDPS bow with two additional arrows and crafted crit chance. This thing is worth a lot. Let's see what happens to it. Oh, ouch. That hurt me. It's not even my item and it hurts. Oh, all right, let's go next. What do we have next? We've got this beautiful chest. It is double elevated frenzy charge. Attack crit, perfectly divined, additional curse, unveiled life mana, and a bit of dex. I'm not 100% sure what this is worth. 50, 60, X. I'm not going to price check it, but let's see what we get. Oh, dude. Zeus, I'm sorry, man. All right, we have these fancy gloves. They have attack speed, chaos dot, life, max frenzy, and elevated intimidate i'm not 100 sure which build uses these let me know in the comments but let's see what happens oh okay four percent max life and socketed curse gems this i mean it's nice but is it better than that projectile damage implicit i'm not entirely sure i mean at least it didn't break right all right last one from mr zeus this is a very nice quiver additional arrow tier one wed and life crit multi. It's not as good as the one I did last time. And that attack speed is not perfectly rolled, but it's gonna die anyway, right? Oh, okay. This is extra lightning, added cold. I I mean it's not crazy valuable, it's not bad either, but it, it's not like a, a crazy good outcome. Alright, let's go see what else we have lying around in the stash. All right, I lied. I've actually got one more from Zeus. We've got this double hatred watcher's eye with cooldown recovery. It's probably worth about 20, 30 X at most. I'm not sure, but let's see what we get. Increased damage and minion seal increased damage. I mean, it's better than what it was and it's beautifully divine. So they'll be pretty happy with that. Next up on the chopping block, what do we have? 
These are all items from Guitarholic. We've got a nice custom crit bow and some other custom crit gear. I think let's start off with these boots. These are elusive resistance boots. Very, very nice. Oh, oh, okay. Plus two level of AOE, plus two level of curse. That's, I'm not exactly sure what you put in these boots. I don't think it's an insanely good corruption, but it's, it's pretty nice. I mean, if you don't need the extra resistance, maybe there's something going in these boots that's very nice. So, next up, let's do this cost and crypto. This is not worth a fortune. It's actually very nice. This is actually very, very nice. Yeah, I don't know exactly what it's worth, but let's see what happens. Oh, damn, that's pretty nice. Okay, attack speed, bottom roll. I mean, it's it's okay. Wait, this doesn't have any attack speed on it. Maybe that crit multi should have been attack speed, but this is, this is what I was given, all right? Frenzy charge on kill and attack speed, pretty sweet. Although maybe cast and crit already has other sources of frenzy charge on kill, like from the chest or something, but let's go next. Okay, here's a chest. I actually, I'm pretty sure I made this chest and then sold it to Guitarholic. It has elevated attack crit. It has elevated power charge on crit additional curse, ailments, and it just so happens to have percent increased intelligence. Let's see what happens. Everything I create gets destroyed. <laughs> Even if it's not my item anymore, if I made it. Ah. Oh man. Re. Alrighty, here we have an anomalous ice sphere. This is worth about 11x as is. So let's see what happens. 2020, nothing happened. Next up, gloves. We have life projectile attack damage, hybrid cold res damage against chilled enemies, fire res, and crafted crit ch chance. And we got four white sockets. All right, not too bad, Guitarholic. All right, let's do something big. Let's do a squire. This comes to us from Queen Meowza. This shield is worth over 200 exalts. And I'm very scared to click this button. Oh, Queen Meowza, if this breaks, I'm so sorry. Oh, okay. It's not crazy good at all, but I mean, it didn't break. And I think that reduced area damage is probably better than the stun and block recovery. It survived. It survived. That's all that matters. Okie dokie. We have these boots for neighbor. These are exquisite they have elusive life movement speed elevated tailwind elevated onslaught and ignites you inflict deal damage faster and guess what this time they're actually divined they're actually divined very nicely so let's see what we get oh nice that is really good plus one max endurance charges socketed curse jumps is also i mean it's not crazy but plus one endurance charges that is mm, very juicy oh we have neighbors head on to let's see what happens oh oh no i'm sorry all right rip well at least your boots were good right at least your boots were good next up we have this bow from kwong this i crafted in a video it's just a cost and crit bow let's see what happens Six white sockets. Very nice. And I didn't six link it because I knew I was going to double corrupt it. So now we can just use some tainted fusings. But that's not a bad outcome. Nice. Let's see what we get next. Next up, we have this interesting little chest. It has additional curse, attack crit, and socketed gems are supported by level 10 rarity. Not exactly sure what this is worth. Probably, probably not a fortune, but let's see what happens. You got... He got one more white socket. <laughs> Cute. All right, let's move on. Okay, next, Divergent Creeping Frost. It's worth about four to five X like this. Let's see what we get. Ooh, lost the level. All right, well, that's not worth as much anymore. What do we have? We have these gloves, very similar to the ones I made that I double corrupted last. Max Frenzy Charges, Elevated Strike Skills, Tier 1 attack speed, unveiled crit multi Ellie damage, and crafted res. Let's see what we get. Oh, oh, oh my god! 
Oh, 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 oh. oh shit. That is so big. That is so big. <laughs> oh, oh, I knew. Oh, why didn't this happen to mine? Oh, cannabis corpse. That's. <laughs> oh my god. These things are worth. Oh. Oh my goodness. That is probably the sickest corruption I've ever got. That is so nuts. All right, all right, all right. I, oh, give me a sec. What the hell are these things worth? Wow. Wow, wow. I did not expect that. I'm still just so shocked by this. This, I'm pretty sure it's worth like a couple of mirrors. Let's do this anomalous precision. It's worth 13-ish X and now it's worth less than 13-ish X. Sorry, guitar holic. All right, awakened cost on crit thing costs about 12x. Let's see what we get. Six. Yay, when it's my, I, I'm good at double corrupting gems apparently. Apparently this is worth 50 exalts. That's nice. Cool. This is neighbor's headhunter. Let's see what we get. Oh, another brick. Yikes, the headhunter. Success rate, this video has not been good. Actually, you know what? I lied. This was Zeus's belt. And wow. Zeus had some some pretty pretty bad <laughs> luck. <laughs> anyway, you know what time it's for? It's mage blood time. And then it's this axe time. This comes to us from fire. Mage blood is currently sitting at about 580-600x. It's been hovering about 1.5 mirrors the entire league. Oh boy. All right. I'm scared. Thank you, Fire, for giving us the opportunity to do this. I have a bad feeling. I feel like it's going to just disappear. Three, two, one. Nothing happened. I hate it when that happens. Oh man, I've double crafted a couple of these this league and just every time nothing happens. I guess, hey, you still have a 600x belt. That's a that's a pretty good outcome. What the hell, why is there an Ziri in this temple? I didn't sign up for this. We have another cast on crit awakened and we got extra quality. Got another anomalous ice spear, it costs 11x, and now, ooh, 21. Now it's worth 36x. Wow, okay, I've got good luck with this. This wasn't Guitaraholics one, sorry, I went out and bought it. Now, I'm gonna do one of my items. I feel like it's, it's only fair that I put something on the line too. This is a very nice shield. It has 459 energy shield, tier one crit chance for spells, unveiled fire and chaos res, and crafted cold and chaos res. Very nice shield that I made to replace the last one that bricked. Oh, for goodness sake. Okie dokie, Rob gave us this cute little regalia. Well, it's not very cute and it has 700 energy shield and some nice suffixes. Let's see what happens. Oh, Rob. Oh, ow. It uh, bricked, sorry. Alrighty, we have another headhunter from Chiromatic. It's so not properly divined or blessed, but let's see. Yeah, yeah, that's not that good, right? Unless malevolence, maybe some like bleed bow head onto build. Let me know what you think. Is that cool? Is that uncool? Worse than a normal head onto? All right, we have this awakened GMP from Chiromatic, worth about thirty-five ish X. If we hit level six, maybe it'll be worth a hundred. No, oh, ouch, okay. That's not good. And of course, I can't not do one of my own headhunters. So I went out and bought this, divined it, all that. Let's see. Uh, at least I didn't die. Okay, for context, this is a 1,081 PDPS act that cost too much to make. Three, two, one. Did I click it? Is it gone? Is it gone? 
I'm so scared. I'm just gonna like look at chat quickly. Oh no! Oh no! Fuck! Get rolled Reddit. Fuck! That's so boring. That's so boring. <laughs> no. No. My 1,000 PDFs X. Oh no. This is devastating. How must I go to sleep Get after this? Reddit. Well, 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 we've come to the end of our very long journey. Let's go over some of the highlights. So Queen Meowza, she walked away with some very nice headhunters. Not entirely sure what these are worth. They're pretty hard to price check. She did lose two headhunters and her squire survived. I don't think these are particularly valuable implicit. However, it didn't lose value, shall I say. It didn't lose value. Now we have Chiromatic Boots from the last video. Zeus, oh man, Zeus, you had a rough time. This beautiful bow bricked. These gloves got max life. Not sure that's better than the projectile damage that was on it. This chest bricked. This, uh, this quiver, I, I don't think that those are better than the global crit chance. Let's see, Guitarholic. All right, he got four white sockets. This chest, because I crafted it, <laughs> it bricked, of course. And then he got these lovely implicits on this Phoenix Song Spine Bow. It's a cast on crit bow, got a bit of attack speed and frenzy charge on kill. Pretty juicy. And his booties. Well, AoE and curse gems. Not bad. Not amazing either, but pretty cool. This is, I believe, Zeus's headhunter. Yep, Zeus. I'm sorry, man. You got destroyed. And Zeus's watcher's eye. Very nice little implicit. The max damage is good. Minion seal, increased damage, eh, kind of useless. But let's see what else we have. Starting over here, neighbor. Very, very, very nice corruption on these boots that were actually divined before they were given to me. So good job. Plus one max endurance charges, plus one socketed curse gems. Very, very good. Not entirely sure what they're worth, but they're worth a lot more than they were before. Next, we have this cost on crit bow that I crafted for Quang. Now has six white sockets, cool. And then extreme bolt tackle. His chest got a bonus white socket. It had five before he gave it to me, but now it has six. Now let's see, Rob, sorry about your chest, rip. Then we have a level six awakened cast on crit worth about, I think 50 X. We got a level 21 anomalous ice spear worth probably 30 ish X. And then for the big ones, the big ones, Mage Blood, Mage Blood, you survived. Cool. Fire, I'm sure you're very happy with that. And then the absolute, oh, these things, these gloves. Unfreaking believable. Plus one max frenzy charges, elevated strike skills, tier one attack speed, unveiled global crit chance, and crafted on fire res, and then. Fizz attack damage leashes mana. I think that's, it's not terrible. It's not great, but it's not bad. But on top of that, absolutely insane implicits. Plus one max frenzy charges. Attacks have 0.6% crit chance. Let's have a, a quick look and price check these. But my prediction, these are worth probably a few mirrors. Some people probably think that's ridiculous. I'm completely overvaluing it, but let's see. Are there any in standard? Nope, none in standard. None in league with just, I'm just searching max frenzy and attack crit. That's it. Just the frenzy. There's none in standard. Well, no, there's definitely some in standard. There's none online in league. Any? One result. Check this out. This dude wants six mirrors for this. I mean, eh, come on. One max frenzy charges, 89 life. These are these are nice, but this is not elevated. Absolutely worth a fortune. So congratulations, Cannabis Corpse. You are the winner of this end of league double corruption. But to everyone else who contributed, Queen Meowza, again, I'm gonna link her channel in the description. Thank you for all the headhunters. Thank you for the squire and Zeus. 
and Kwong and Guitarholic and Fire and Extreme Volt Tackle, Neighbor. Oh, <laughs> I didn't go over the axe. The axe ripped. Oh no. How sad is that? But <laughs> I was too excited about the gloves. Yep, axe ripped. Sorry, me. Well, you know. Oh, and my shield ripped. Ah, <sighs> anyway. That's going to be it for this video, and I believe that's also going to be it for 3.16. The announcement for 3.17 is coming out this Thursday, so I'll catch you for that, and I'll catch you for spoiler season, and of course for the new Siege of the Atlas expansion. Have a wonderful day, everyone. Thank you for watching this league and all leagues. Catch you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye. Exile, you're making me nervous.